Nero 7 is now out. We have the AI Blades, which came out recently as well. I've been using those. I really like them. Any blade update for me out there? Yeah, actually there is. So let me put these down and let me grab a blade. All right, so here we have actually the uh, the silver. The silver means it's a uh, freshwater. Freshwater. This is a freshwater blade. This is a saltwater show, Jay. I know. Reef, Bye. reef up Palooza, reef. There's no reef in freshwater. <laughs> Jimmy's got like, a freshwater tank. Yeah, I'm like, well, yeah, and I mean, uh, where'd your journey start? All right, so moving on. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a freshwater blade now, and a couple yep. minutes, the whole blade lineup. Well, yeah, I mean, we, we launched all, all the blades at the same time, but yes, there's, a, there's freshwater blades. These go in all the same sizes as the saltwater. Okay. Um, all the way up to, I believe it's, what, six foot? You're, you're calling that. my product launch. It is over that. Um, but yeah, I mean, check on the website, obviously, aquilumination.com. You can see all the different sizes that are available. Uh, two different finishes, silver, which indicates the freshwater, uh, black, which indicates the marine versions. Uh, there may be, we may, who knows in the future, you might be able to get the other color heat sink for the other, the other type. But, uh, and then there's the freshwater, there's the grow and the glow. So we have the same controllability on the freshwater blade as the saltwater with the app? Yes, so absolutely. And we know that a lot of our saltwater customers are also freshwater aquarists as well, because obviously it's, it's a journey, it's a lifestyle, and yeah. you're not really one or the other, you're an aquarist. Um, so because of that, you know, we wanted to make sure we finally had a form factor in addition to the prime that really works for, for freshwater applications in a way that people really want it. Uh, light spectrum is balanced the same way as our others for, for freshwater. And then um, in addition to this, then obviously there's also the refugium. The refugium version of the blade comes in a 12 inch. So uh, designed for your sump, yeah. great sump algae grower because it is also water resistant. So it's small, it's compact, sits right there on top of your sump the way you want it. Uh, using these mounts or some of the other mounting accessories which you can get for the blade as well. For instance, these are raised blade mounts. So obviously the smaller versions of the blade come with these. Uh, larger versions come with not these or these. They come with uh, clips that work with the HMS mounting system. But then these are one of the several after, I shouldn't say aftermarket, they're our accessories for the blade. So you can either raise it up, you can mount them in multiples, all sorts of things. Again, website has all of that information. Lots of options, however you want to do it. Saltwater, freshwater, in-tank flow, all controlled through an app, all in the same ecosystem, which is expanding. Super fast to set up. I mean, you know that. You've, you've used a bunch Nothing of these products. To it. Yep. Within minutes, you can put this on, and then they also have um, button control like the other products. Much more limited, lets you just cycle through the intensities, but if you're somebody who really doesn't want to use apps to control your light, you just want to plug it in and go after it, then you can adjust your intensity using that button.